Oh, real quick, we're going to talk at the beginning because I don't think I said it at the beginning. Uh, this is part one of four. Uh, tomorrow you guys will be getting a video where we talk about... This is a uh, Minecraft world that we played with viewers uh, that joined the stream. This first world was about a year in the making. And then this video tomorrow we're going to talk about world two. Uh, a deleted world, which was world four. Because I still have one video that still exists of it. Uh, because it got it bugged out when the aquatic update came out and then we had to find a new map and then between world four and five i have about three small maps that we played a day or two on stream uh day three will be a giant world which was world three um which we spent about a year and a half to two years on and world five which will be video four um which we spent about six months on um, I'll say right now, this map was probably created back in 2015, 2006, 16, we talk about that. But otherwise, this is for a big thank you for you guys reaching 1,500 subscribers on YouTube. We had 1,650 subscribers, so, uh, this is a really big thank you so much for all the support. Uh, but I wanted to show you off some of the worlds in the past that we did for only Twitch, uh, Twitch reviewers. And this is part one of uh, part one of four, um, the first world. Like I said, we spent about a year on this map, and uh, this is probably this is one of the only maps we ever use creative on. Uh, to show you the other maps, well, when we get to video three and four, so the twenty sixth and twenty seventh, when we get to their videos, I'll sign in a split screen profile and show you that they can get achievements on their worlds. Um, just because those worlds are not on creative um, and they will take longer because I have to get around everywhere uh, manually but otherwise uh, hope you guys do enjoy the video and here we go this is this is right. so we'll probably do this for the next four days that's my guess for this And we're going to show you, first of all, I have to find the first one. Okay. So we're going to go through a bunch of worlds. This first one, it says survival, but we did, this first one was made where the host was in creative. Basically, these worlds are all worlds that I did with viewers on Twitch uh, back in the day. So, I need to put this into creative. This world is the only one that we did. Actually, this one and uh, tomorrow's video will be a few honorable mentions where we spent a week on a world. Or we spent a couple of days on. So, or a world that got lost uh, because a update uh, broke it. So, it will be a short video tomorrow. But, uh, this is the only one that we did do on creative. So we'll play this world. Um, I'm gonna be showing you a bunch of stuff. I was gonna do just one video for all four or five worlds that we have, um, but actually, well, four big worlds and then, no, it's like three, four big worlds and then three or four small worlds. So. Okay, so when we spawn, uh, we actually didn't spawn up there, which is surprisingly. Uh, I, that's probably because, let me put myself into creative, uh, how do I do this again? It's a long time since I've done creative. Um, So 
settings. So basically, I was in creative the entire time. Um, like I said, this is the one world where me and two of the moderators. There's always, we had, I think, three or four moderators that watched this server with me. And they would cycle out because you could only have eight people back then. Uh, so this is like a 360 world. And it was always changing who was the moderator on. Uh, and we had different bases for each one. So, I'll explain everything. So, if we go up here. This is the start. Uh, one of the days before we open this world, I wanted to put this up. So, this is the start. You start up here and you can drop down the chute towards spawn. Um, on this side, there are parkour and with checkpoints. This was hard parkour. Hard parkour for people who were not good at it. So this one gave you a diamond sword. Parkour master one, sharpness five, knockback two. Um, there's a parkour number two over here. I think I was working on a third parkour station. Should have had two. Yeah. So there was a, I remember that just briefly about this. I had, I think four treasure hunt books that you could find around the map. If you brought me all four, I gave you a special diamond armor set, uh, that was called the treasure hunting, uh, the treasure hunting set. This was the harder parkour section, which I only had two people ever beat this one. This was Master Parkour number two. We got that pickaxe. Uh, there's these lines down here. In case you fell, you could just land on that die real quick. So, we had Parkour. Someone, one of my moderators, was making a giant pixel art. I don't even know what this would be. Because this is a years old. This is probably... This is at least 2015, 2016, when we were working on some stuff on here. There's houses everywhere, because a lot of people joined this map, so everybody had a house. We have the Teen Titans Tower over here. One of the moderators' bases you can see is right here. Um... When the when the map map first started off, I had an area where people could come and get free items to start off with, but then people would just go there and break the chests or take ev like everything they could and then come back and just keep taking it, so they just have chests full of items. So I stopped giving free items and it started becoming if you want certain things, you either ask for it or. Most times you got it yourself. Um, that's how you could let people up the tower. You could flip those levers. But this was the moderator's building that we made. Uh, so if one of the moderators on did not have a place to stay, they could stay up here inside the tower. I believe there were special stuff up here. So it's been a long time since any of us have been in this world. Me included. Uh, oh yeah, that wouldn't work anymore. Whatever. But yeah, this was the Myra's Tower. Technically, you could jump off of there uh, and survive onto this. Um, the second Myra's house that got built this used to be a lake here, as you can tell from the sand everywhere. This used to be a lake, and I think we took sponge one day and cleared it because people were building all inside of it. Uh, the second Myra's base was over here. Someone was building a giant tree. His base was right here. He was letting people build next to him. That's why we have, like, 
believe this was one of the houses I built just so someone could have. I did that a lot on the server. Whenever I got bored, I would come on here and when we were streaming, I would build a house and just let anybody move in. Call, I would put a sign saying vacant, so this was one of them. Um, yeah, we have his tower there. This is another thing I built for one day on stream. It's the Eye of, Sar Eye of Sar uh, Sauron. Um, also, somewhere over here, where all these vacant houses are, there is a glass wall that we started building. You can see it here. I was going to make a portion of this map a Hunger Games area, where we could try, like, maybe weekly Hunger Games. But, uh, I'll say right now, eventually we stopped using this map. I don't know why. I think maybe because the new Minecraft came out and it was on Xbox One and they you couldn't transfer worlds yet or something stupid that it wouldn't let us transfer this world. So we never been, was able to use this world. Otherwise, we would use this world a whole lot more. And also, this world, if I show it off, that's the world. Wherever, where all that water is around the border... That's how big the world was, the inner portion. Um, there's so many creations here. We could go through and make this like an hour video just showing off different creations that people have made. Um, little chibi art. Boxing arena. Different bases. Some of these bases still have names on them. The Devil's Child base. Stay out. Some of these probably won't have names on them just because I was trying to get people to put their names on it so they people would stay out of their bases so they know it's not vacant. And some people would listen, some people wouldn't. Um, Alaska YouTube. Just run around and do some big bases before I show you one of the ninja. Uh, one of the, my favorite modern bases that someone has ever made. Uh, which I'll show you eventually is the Bat Cave. Uh, and I believe it was two people who created it. Well, one person created it and then someone helped when the other virus helped. I had, and this, I will say, I'll, some of the old moderators that helped me create this map, some of them are not even on a moderator list anymore for Twitch, just because it's been forever. Um, and they don't play anymore. So I, I would like to say... I would like to say it's probably either Dark Souls, which I think is still a moderator on Twitch, or it's another guy who played a lot. I just can't think of his name. So over here we had a Thieves Guild at one point that got destroyed. Um, also, before we stopped using the map... Um, I made a new spawn, so whenever they gave us permission to change spawn, this was the new one. See the yin yang I had? This was the spawn that I was gonna make people spawn. Uh, see if they could spawn down here. Uh, this was gonna be the new spawn, so when people spawned in, it wasn't over there, it would be over here somewhere, so people could then build from here on out. Maybe we'll, we will come to this world again in the future. Um, I'm going to show you the Batcave. Batcave is layered by bedrock, so you can't mine into it if you wanted to. I believe it is over here. In the side of the hill, he grew trees to protect it. I mined out of it just to see, but down here, there's two entrances. 
Yeah, it's Dark Souls Bat Cave. Some rooms weren't complete yet. I'll say that right now. Like this was still being worked on. I think this room over here had... Okay, so someone broke in. The whole thing wasn't complete with Bedrock yet. Someone broke in and broke some outfits, but he had every single outfit from different... Different Robins and that. Made... I have the Joker set. Um, he had the Batman outfit. Here's the Batmobile. I believe this led to a secret exit way out that no one ever found. Uh, I think I was the Joker because I kept on trying to lead people into the Batcave. The one time I actually accidentally led someone in here, they actually found their way in was the one that destroyed the map. Uh, the, these used to be empty maps. Uh, yeah, Joker's Bane, so let's sell. So he really spent a lot of time in this base. Like I said, this was his. This was his uh, base that he, he moderated from. There, there's iron golems everywhere for bat, bat cave guardians. What was over here? Oh yeah, the bed. Yeah, so this is, if not, one of the best moderator bases I've ever seen built when I gave a moderator creative to go mess around with. And like I said, this is, this was the first world that I allowed creative. Uh, there was one other world that we did creative, but we didn't activate creative until we actually started building we built in survival about a couple days, like five, six days in survival with it, and then allow creative and let people join. So, but, and then after that point, we never use creative again. So, we'll exit the that cave. I'll block it back off. I think the thing has a incredible my bedrock protectant now. Uh, if you guys do eventually want me to, like, eventually I will come back to be either I'll either stream on YouTube or Twitch. I'm gonna do Minecraft for viewers again, and there's two maps that when I do stream on the Xbox, we'll probably either use, and this could be one map. If you guys want me to stream this, we'll try this again. Um, God damn it, I must have went by dirt. The other world I will show on day three. Um, okay, now we're gonna go over to a different section of the map. Like I said, I could probably stay on this map and just show off stuff for hours. At least two, three hours. It's the same way map three is gonna be. Because this map, we probably built stuff on for at least a year worth of time. Every week, we did one or two streams on this. So, like, over here, I remember spending a lot of time. Built this quick house. Because someone was building a giant fort over here. Which had a couple people living in it. It never got done, as you can see. Um... I think we had another moderator's base and this was the last one and I can remember this the most just because me and I helped someone build this church whose church was this dark shadow world wolves so I can remember helping build this one I think I reset the nether I don't know if there's anything in here actually we're gonna check real quick. I don't think there is, that's why I was gonna stay out of it, but it might be. 
Yeah, I reset the nether. Okay, that's good to know. Where did we spawn? I don't know if I reset the nether because we as we have spawned over. We spawned over by the Io Sar uh, Sar Sauron. I think that's what that's called. It just looked neat, so I built it. I would. I tried multiple times to just land on that. Like I was like, that's the only option I see. It would not. It would prevent me from landing on it. But that's just because I had to move onto it constantly. <sighs> there was no no actual puzzle when it came to that. Huh. Fucking. It was exactly what I thought. It was just being stupid. There's a lot of builds on this map. Like I said, uh, we spent a lot of time on it. There's probably secret bases and stuff that I don't even remember. When we hit the third map that I'm going to be showing you off probably one secret chest I have. I have at least 10 on the map just because in case ev anything ever went wrong, like a base ever got destroyed, I could have extra resources back by it uh, to help people out in the area. Uh, this was a base that someone was working on. I remember finding them all they're doing here But like for most bases like that we probably won't find a sign who owns it just because It that one's in a waterfall uh, There is a hole here. Oh, yeah, this is the dungeon Yeah, this is I I would think this is either 2015 or 2016 that we did this map. And we did this for almost a year. Uh, we got this, which I don't know if it's going to work anymore. Oh, it is. Someone made the color change in beacon. They asked for certain blocks. I gave it to them. Uh, that used to be the world height limit. And then... We got change. Maybe not. I don't know. Like some of this, I do remember. Some of this, I have, like I said. Okay, we're heading over to the second town that was being built. So over here, there were villages all over the place. I made a natural jungle biome in case people need jungle trees, which is up here. This was the area where people were just starting to move into and I built some fun things over here too this is going to be a longer video than I thought but that's fine I think there was a yeah secret house down here it was just a room that we could stay into um Okay, we're moving up to the top corner of the map, and this is the final area of the map where we were working on stuff. Uh, this, pr These projects probably had the least amount of time on them. I can, I can remember this watchtower. Wherever this is up here. Oh, this was uh, parkour course number three. This is what that was. I was trying to remember where our parkour course number three was. I know we had a third one, and we were working on it. This was course number three. Um, as you can see, it's a jump-in type maze type thing. And we worked on this one forever. I think it was still work in progress or... See, I think, yeah, True Fob made this, but I was helping with this. I remember coming over and finding this one, and I was like, I'm going to help with this. Uh... So there was water down here at one point in time. I don't know where it went. So there, we probably did have a reward. Okay. So we probably did have a reward. This is another area that I 
I was clearing out at one point for people to build, make it more flat. Because at a certain point we hit the like we were having buildings everywhere to be created. So if we do come back and use this map at some point, I will put a reward at the end of that one. I will have to have uh, get. I'll have to get moderators back on to help watch people on this. Okay, so up here was the second town. Where for, I think, two or three weeks, I put the spawn point of the map right here. So you spawned right here. And... Or you spawned, like, right over here or somewhere. Else, and I let people cr craft things. I made the air balloon... And people just went out on with the day, just crafting stuff. And there's some projects over here, like I said, that are incomplete just because we stopped playing this map because it wouldn't transfer over. Um, we were working on a prison over here, as you can tell. This was, I think, me, Dark Soul, and an old moderator called Jesse, which he doesn't play xbox anymore i think he transferred to pc this was going to be the ban prison so if you broke the rules at any point like doing the parkour course or if you're griefing or cheating we would put you in there and if you it would be like a 30 minute ban for the first one and then after that it'd be a two hour ban after that it'd be a 24 hour ban and then if you cheat anymore you'd just be banned from the Map. So you had three strikes basically, or four strikes if you count it that way. Um, so, otherwise, I think that's it. There's one more thing over here I just have to find. It's a bedrock, bedrock box that I made right here. So back in the day, we had Hunger Game maps that I would go through. And whenever someone won the Hunger Game map that I hosted, I would put their name up here. So like my Mario, Dark Souls won five times. Randy won. Toxic won. Best DJ won. Bronco two. Devil Child two. Lego Kid one. Swiftbound two. That name sounds very familiar. Prudent Kid. Kill. All these names do sound familiar. This is... Yeah. First donation to the stream. It was like $5 or something. And here's the first person to beat Parkour Course 2. Is True Fob. Back in the day, he was a... A incredible person. He came to like every stream. Played every day with us. Um... At one point, I offered him. Um, right now, I I remember at one point I offered him moderatorship because we lost one of the moderators because they stopped playing and never really showed up again. Like I think they said goodbye uh, a while, like a long time ago, and then they said oh can't play exit box anymore so i'm saying goodbye i won't be on any other streams from this point on and we're like okay so when we lost that moderator i i asked true fob um if he he wanted to be a moderator because i usually ask that person in chat like privately and he said no so he said he'd rather just watch than be my raider. So I said fine. And I think we've I think that's how we got Jesse as a moderator. He was a moderator for at least a year and a half to two years. Um We can see this this whole area over here on the map. I don't think there's any buildings down this bottom left hand portion. Just because this is where we're gonna put Hunger Games. Some of the smaller buildings here I think I made just because I was going to start making buildings inside a dome for places to find stuff. Otherwise, I think that's every big thing I can remember for this map. Like I said, this is the oldest map out of all of them. 
map map number three when we hit map number three map number two is a week long uh that we spent on um map number three i think we spent a year and a half to two years in it's probably the longest minecraft world when we hit map four map four got deleted because of the update map five which would be for video four um because i'll talk about map three in the video for uh tomorrow but uh map five we spent map five is a pc map that i still have and we have spent probably at least three four months on that map so far Otherwise, like I said, I have a bunch of small bases. I just, also, when I'm flying over it, this used to be a house. And one of the times I had to go on creative to fix something. So I allowed like two or three people that were in the game at the time to go creative too. Two of them were helping me. A third one was over here just doing their own stuff. And I gave them a roll. You guys could take stuff from the inventory, but no diamond. No, like no actual material that you could upgrade your stout your stuff with like iron gold diamond and about probably a couple days later we found someone found when they were over here randomly they found that he had a secret chest full with diamond blocks so he broke that rule and i let dark souls choose the punishment and he blew up the base because uh Dark Souls realized over the last couple days, the base they built, were, they were using all diamond tools just to get everything. So, Dark Souls made the decision to break the entire base. Then I think that guy quit. He never played again. But I was perfectly fine with it because... I might also say, oh, what is this then? I think I went on here for a little bit messing around. So, like, there was days where I spent just trying to rebuild stuff. Or build upon stuff that we did in the past. Otherwise, I think I'm going to put myself like this. Uh, and let stuff load in. Um, otherwise, that this is map one. Uh, worlds with viewers um if you guys like video like if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel I recommend subscribing to the channel uh to keep up with all content otherwise i think i will be putting this out the 24th so new year's not new year's but i said new year's christmas eve this will come out christmas like i said you guys will be getting a smaller video um it's probably gonna be shorter because i have to go through five or six maps and then uh 26 Day of Christmas, we'll do a bigger video because the map is huge and it's all in survival. Same thing with the fourth video. This is also, if you guys didn't realize, this is also a thank you for you guys uh, for us hitting 1,500 subscribers. But also, I'd say we've hit, um, I believe it's 1,650, so another 150 added on to that. Uh, I was going to do this at 1,500 and I've just been taking my time. Um, so, but otherwise that is me, uh, most of the buildings, like I said, eventually I will come back with Minecraft with viewers again, uh, and I will give you guys the option, uh, when we're playing, uh, Xbox, if you want this world or the other world, or, or we'll probably swap every so often back and forth. Um, like I said, this, this base, this start in platform, I think actually, start was going to be down here because you couldn't put start right there because there's spawn on the roof so i put start down here uh and i was gonna put this was the border border of the map that's why it's like that that way but if we ever did do this again it would be boats here so you could explore that way build stuff or you could come this way and check out old buildings or build and if, like I said, if we do pick up this map, I will start doing more parkour courses and other stuff to let people get items. Um, otherwise, it'd be either this or World 3 that we'll eventually visit. Uh, otherwise, 
thank you guys so much for watching if you guys like video like if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel I recommend subscribing to the channel to keep up with all the content otherwise i will see you guys in tomorrow's video where we go over the smaller worlds where uh either we spent a week or less on it because we were trying to find a decent world to spawn in or or it got deleted like world number four i think world number four we spent about six seven months in uh doing twitch streams and then it got deleted because of the aquatic update uh but yeah i think that's pretty much it let me see if i can find people messing with other people on here i remember this Otherwise, yeah, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, yeah, so we'll talk about world number two, which world number two, like I said, lasted a week. We did about three, four days of survival, and then I turned it in grave. Uh, and you'll actually see one of the chess systems that we did. Um, it was the first world that I did on Xbox One, and then I said, screw it, we're not doing Xbox One. I'll go back on 360 and just stream on that. And we did more of this world. Um, and then there's at least two or three worlds that we started up, and I started building on, but we never went anywhere with it. Uh, after World 4, before we did World 5 on the PC, there's about three or four worlds I created that lasted a day or two on stream uh, before we found World 5. Um, so, and we'll talk about the delete world. But otherwise, that will be what we'll be doing tomorrow. And then, like I said, day three will be a long video. Uh, and day four will be a somewhat long video. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good morning, have a good afternoon, have a good night. Wherever you are, just have a good day. I'll see you guys in the next video. And peace.